Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Uh, today I'm gonna do a video about uh, how to set up a dual monitor system uh, for laptops. Earlier, about um, a month or so, I did a video about how to set up dual monitor system for laptops with single USB Type-C cord. And that video almost got 9,000 views. Uh, and I haven't addressed um, over there uh, how to set up dual monitor setup for um, laptops like Acer Spin 5 where you have at least one HDMI or VGA port and a USB 3.0 or 2.0 port um, which is fairly cheap so uh, today we are gonna talk about that uh, so without further ado let's get into it if you guys are new to our channel please make sure you subscribe to our channel we do a lot of tech reviews videos and how to videos just like this one uh, and by doing so you're helping our channel to grow and also making sure that you don't miss any upcoming videos from to our channel so let's get started so here I am on my uh, office setting uh, I have done video already about uh, the Zenbook 3 uh, this is my super lightweight and super fast laptop uh, but the problem is uh, it only has one USB type-c port uh, which leads me with no options for adaptability so what I had to do was I had to get a USB uh, C uh, adapter with all the multi ports which I have talked about in depth in a video I did for this laptop which is linked up here and at the end of the video so make sure you check it out if you have a laptop like this but in today's video we will be using uh, my other laptop which is the Acer Spin 5 this is a very nice uh, flip tablet uh, like uh, laptop pretty fast um, it has 13.3 inch display uh, with touchscreen uh, option um, but in this laptop I do get a lot of adaptability options like I have an HDMI to USB uh, 3.0 port USB type C charging and on the other hand I got an extra USB C with SD card reader and all the other port but if you have this Acer Spin 5 or any laptop which has one HDMI or VGA which is pretty much rare because newer laptops nowadays have HDMI rather than uh, VGA or DVI uh, but you need at least one of these and one USB uh, either 3.0 or 2.0 port doesn't really matter I would usually rather prefer to have one more to attach your uh, printer keyboard uh, mouse and a lot of other options on top of the uh, charging port so if you have uh, these options then this is the video for you and all you need for uh, this setup to work is um, a port like this so I have uh, this uh, USB 3.0 to HDMI uh, adapter which I got it for about $30 from Amazon I have linked the purchase link in the description down below uh, check it out if you want to get it um, it was fairly delivered quickly in two days uh, because of Amazon Prime uh, speaking of which uh, if you want to try Amazon Prime for free for 30 days with zero obligation make sure you click on the link in the description down below and you can try Amazon Prime and I'm pretty sure you'll love it uh, so uh, once you get this it really you, you really need to check your monitor as well I have two monitor one is Asus which has HDMI VGA and DVI uh, my other uh, monitor is Acer which only has uh, DVI and and VGA it does not have HDMI so what I had to do is uh, I had to purchase uh, a converter like this so this is also available on Amazon link is in the description but this converts the DVI signal to an HDMI uh, signal so what happens is I can connect my DVI to HDMI. The reason why I got HDMI in the first place is because all the newer monitors does have HDMI. Uh, unless if you are just uh, keen on keeping one monitor with you forever, which is rare, then you need to get, uh, let's say if you have something like this, then you can get USB 3.0 to VGA as well. But I usually keep it up to uh, modern standards. So I got HDMI and then you can obviously get converters like like this um, now I'm gonna set it up uh, to my uh, laptop and I'm gonna show you in real time how it looks uh, so 
this is uh, for the Acer monitor and I'll attach it up right here um, I do have a USB 3.0 to times 4 USB 3.0 where I have my mouse and my keyboard attached so I'm gonna attach it uh, right around here then I'm gonna insert the HDMI and then I'm gonna insert this USB-C and that should set up. Uh, I will flip this screen down so that uh, everything is functional. And as you can see right away, it has three display setting over there. Uh, most of the newer laptops are compatible to um, display two additional uh, display on top of its own. Uh, if you are someone who wants to have three three displays uh, on top of your own then you have to get something like this so this is uh, these are fairly expensive this is a pluggable USB-C uh, docking station and you can see it has two HDMI and one DVI it also has built-in graphics so it can uh, output uh, your own your uh, the laptop screen and three more displays on top of that uh this is for 239 dollar uh it's on sale right now on amazon the link is in the description down below but for me personally this setting works uh and uh, all i needed was just this uh usb uh 3.0 to hdmi uh, converter and that solves the problem so I really hope you found this uh, video helpful. Please share this video so it, it can reach out to other people. Like this video and make sure you subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any upcoming videos. And thank you so much for watching uh, this video. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Till then, take care.